you've been a major part of the rise of Afghanistan's cricket and more recently getting to the semi-final of that ICC Men's T20 World Cup, which is probably, if not the highest point in Afghanistan's cricket. How has that impacted you as a player and, and Afghanistan's cricket? But reaching to the semi-final was a big achievement for us back home in Afghanistan. But I think, you know, the cricket we play, the skills we have, I felt we totally deserve. And uh, I mentioned before as well, you know, I think before the World Cup, that statement from Brian Lara was big for us. Because someone like him putting us in the top four is, is big, is huge. And uh, that's how we got the more motivation from that. That if he thinks, why not for us to have that belief? Even though I spoke to him as well before the competition, we won't let you down. We will try to prove that. And um, he was quite happy with that. Now, having had the experience of playing in the inaugural Major League Cricket competition here last year, now in 2024, if you had to advise, and, and, and maybe give a pulse as to where United States of America's cricket is, what would you say and, and what would be your recommendations for this cricket locally to follow a similar path to Afghanistan? In Afghanistan, earlier stage, we had no grounds, nothing. But here, you know, they already have MLC happening. They have the domestic good structure, they have the ground, they have the full support and everything. I don't think so there will be any reason they don't achieve what they want and uh, it all comes you know from the hard work and just uh, put your head down and, and do your hard work doesn't matter whatever happens around you just try your best to give that hundred percent for the country and, and, and represent the country you know we have seen uh, USA team in the last World Cup how good they did you know it just a kind of maybe was a surprise for some some people but I uh, know some of the players, you know, and I know that their skills and talent and that's the great thing, you know, in upcoming four, five years, they're going to be in different level. As long as their process is very simple, their thinking is very strong and uh, belief is there that we can achieve anything we want. But it's just uh, about, you know, they need to have that belief in their own skills, doesn't matter. Like for us, I told one thing to the team is, don't think about the opposition strong points and weak points. That is something which is, uh, for me, is I, I don't really think about it. What is my best way of beating the team? What is my best cricket where I can beat the teams? And I need to bring that cricket into the middle. The, that's the only way we can beat the teams. If we do think about the opposition strong and weak points a lot, yes, you do have them in the mind, but do think a lot. Don't think a lot about it. So I think, uh, you know, I, 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 I spoke the other day to a few of my teammates as well, you know, we had a group call last night and I just told them USA cricket is going to be in different level in upcoming years because uh, one is the Major League, all the best quality players coming, they're playing here with those players uh, and uh, the fear you have in the mind, you just take it out here and then you're facing them in international level, that becomes easier for us. Thank you so much.